All right, Hunter. We just we talked on Periscope. You're actually my first live interview on Periscope. Cool. Have you even seen Periscope yet? Do you even no. know what it is? It's like live. Yeah, I got to know a little bit about it. Live streaming on a phone, but yeah. Anyhow, let's talk elbows. Show me the elbows. We got one. that one. These two. What was first? Which one? Um, my right one was first. Your right one was first. Are you right-handed? Yeah. So your right hand, you get that done, and that was March, wasn't it? Or was it? Was it was the end of. March. End of March. So right after NCAs, you come back here to Columbus, you get surgery. Walk me through the process then. So end of March, you get that one done, right one. When does this one get done? They didn't do them together. No, they were. I wanted them to do together just to like, get it done with, but they said that uh, I wouldn't be able to like do anything, but it didn't really matter because I didn't move my couch. So what they did is they had to take a tendon out of my knee. Really? Yeah. So I have, I have a little... You, you got a scar on your knee. Yeah, so I have double surgery. I'm, I have, on both knees and my elbows. So what tendon did they take? Did they tell you? Um, they told me. So what, what actually happened is the tendon that they were gonna take was too small, so they had to take the backup tendon. So I have a small tendon, then I'm like have half like half of a tendon, and I have like another tendon. Could your brother have donated one of his mutant tendons? He could have. I could have got a cadaver one too, but I just like my own. I you like, like your own? Yeah. Okay. Uh, how what was the recovery on the knee, by the way? Uh, it was only a couple of weeks. It was kind of I actually the first surgery I kind of like I milked my knee a lot. It was my first sur like major surgery ever besides like tonsils. So I was like really like kind of like uh, I was kind of like a little girl about it. I was like I couldn't like I was like moving, I was moving around. Logan and my girlfriend had like helped me everywhere, but. Um, I was like walking weird because like my leg, but like you're was, favoring it. Yeah, they realized that I just walk weird normally, so it's not like it wasn't actually my leg. So and then um, did did that one, recovered after you know I was heavily you know, sedated. How many how many weeks apart were the two? Uh, three weeks. Three. They threw three weeks apart. So this one was April. Yeah, April. April and, uh, and your was your knee recovered at that point? Yeah, my my right knee was recovered at that point, but it didn't really matter because I had to get another surgery, and take another tendon from the knee. Other knee then? Yeah, so I had double knee and double. You had double knee and double elbow surgery. Yeah, all four limbs. Yeah, operated on. Yeah. Holy smokes! I did not know that. I don't think a lot of people knew that. Uh, yeah. Looking at the recovery, how's the recovery been so far for you with, with double elbow, Tommy John, and and apparently now double knee surgery. <laughs> Um, knees weren't that bad. I recovered from that, you know, pretty quick. I was running and biking and stuff like that um, soon afterwards. Uh, elbows were kind of slow. Um, it, was, it, it started out pretty good, you know, going fast, um, like rehab stuff like that. But as, as like rehab like started, you started increasing it. Had a not like major setback, but like a little bit of setbacks where you know I started hurting more. So we cut a couple days off and come back on the rehab. Did the, did the days off work? Yeah, yeah. Pain? I mean, it was just like. Um, I don't, I don't know how I expect. Doing too much, maybe? Yeah, I just, you know, we, we like up the rehab like a little bit, and after like maybe a day or two of that, we're like, oh, I can't move my arms. So then I just take a couple days off and I'm fine. Rest. Yeah. Uh, you know, as far as the season, last year, what did you learn from last year? What do you think was the big takeaway? Um, there's a lot, there's probably a few things, but um, I think uh, one, of the, one of the bigger things was, you know, I, I kind of learned that, you know, I can push through a lot of stuff. So you, you went on like tired out there, maybe. Like rest like that, I know I, you know, I can. I still get take down. We can take down with like no arms, with one arm at one point. And so, um, I can push through a lot more stuff. More Learned you can you can push through a lot more. Yeah. Uh, this year, when we can we expect to see back? It's October right now, October 2015. When will we see? Will it be in 2015 or it will be in 2016? Uh, it's looking like it's gonna be 2016. Um, it's a little bit. It's been a little bit slower than I. I I would like and what I thought. Um, I've, I haven't really been on the mat at all. I've been a little bit with my brother, just you know, hitting takedowns, but I can't like get taken out at all yet. So um, it's gonna be it's gonna be probably 2016. Um, sometime, hopefully in January, hopefully beginning, but could be middle. I don't know. All right, the team's breaking in. You guys are doing some sprints. Will you do these sprints now? Uh, yeah, I'll do sprints. All right, I'll let you do the sprints. Hey, thanks for the time. Good luck. We'll see you in January. All right, no problem.